Greetings, coming up in this vlog, the Crown state that Jamaica's prison can accommodate treatment for cartel. Queen Africa sued for allegations against her father and two gone down while one injured, battling for life. I want part of Anova. People don't go nowhere, they want to see us. Ja, ja. With the support of the community, we can definitely solve this crime. I'm imploring on members of the community to support us in solving this crime. Tell us what you know, tell us what you see, tell us what you hear. We need your support. Ah, boy. Welcome to Live Foot TV at the right place. Let's go, don't go nowhere. Please like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell. Bless hello and greetings, my viewers and subscribers, kings and queens, lion and lioness. Good morning, wherever you are. Good morning, Happy Father's Day. You see me to everybody, all of the father them. You see me and say, every day a father day. So we got the father them. We are trying to do them best. You see me, we got the great father too. We are do the best. I have some father I try and some father I do it, isn't it? Yeah, man. So don't forget to like and share the content as usual. My viewers and subscribers. So first, we kick it off with Vibes Cartel. You know, the decision is gonna be made on the 18th. Whether they're gonna release the men them or, you know, they're gonna go for a retrial. You know, but um, the state said the prison can accommodate treatment for cartel based on the grounds what they are saying that he's not well and he need to be bailed and to be out. So the prison system are stating that they can accommodate treatment for him. So it looked like the, well the crown no one let him out. They have intention of going to retrial. So we are we the fans and the viewers have to watch and see what I go on, you know? And think is it. So we see a few comments, you know, some people are say yeah, him for go back and retrial. So, you know, all of people hate cartel and all of people are support him. Likewise, you know, so we are showing the two mixed comments on and, and, and both sides and what the article is saying, the crown is saying. You see me? So, we could kick off cartel first, then we go with Queen Africa. You see me? Yeah. Me? yeah but. The prosecution has told the court of appeal that if it orders a retrial for cartel and his co accused, the prison system has the necessary mechanism in place to deal with the artist's medical condition. So, there you see the uh, prosecution is making it clear, counteracting what cartel defense is saying that he is not well and he needs to be out and all them things. So, they're saying that if it orders a retrial, the more the necessary, the prison system has the necessary. Um, infrastructure mechanism to assist um you know cartel medical conditions so clearly as he said they don't want to let him out they want a retrial it has been confirmed in the hearing that cartel is suffering from grave disease and has a failing heart his heart is said to be operating at 50 percent of its capacity his legal team has argued that he will not survive a retrial so clearly Vibes Cartel legal team, you know, is defense team. Lawyers are saying that, you know, they don't want a retrial because the artist will not survive a retrial. Is it? Why? I don't know my viewers and subscribers, so we have to just watch and see how it will play it out, plays out. So, you know, the, the prosecution is saying clearly that they want the medical treatment and everything in place to assist, assist his health, you know. You see it, so them can us let him out like that. We have to just watch, you know, one day left, one day left for um, to hear the, the, um, the crown decision. You know, I mean, the court of appeal, you know, the judges, them, where they might come with, you see it. So you don't know, because the fans, them, we just want to pray and hope for the best. You know what I mean? And you don't know, we are watching and see what's going on. You see it, and you know, happy Father's Day to Vibes Cartel, same with him, and you know what I mean, them kids, them, because at the end of the day, he's a father, and Another father, father's year spent without his kids. Have you see it? Yes, my viewers and subscribers. So let me know what you think about that. So we have two mixed comments now. Um, first, a person, um, and I saw the comment them from um, under nationwide. You see me? So the, the person um, is against cartel, and this is what the person wrote: "I don't mind paying for a retrial. Justice is needed at any cost. What happened to the right of lizard and the dozens of other people's lives that he had?" taken away, keep him locked up. So he clearly yes, he said a person is against cartel and he must say them justice need to be up to happen, you know? Yeah, and another person responded in the cartel favor by saying, y'all going to look bad at the end of the day. Laugh out loud. So 
the person is very confident that cartel are going to walk. You see me? I'm going to bust off. You see me? Mm-hmm. So, as I said, the 18th, we just have the, the whole world I watch for here while we go on. If a retrial is going to be ordered or the, the men them are going to be set free to go home, you see it? Let me know what you think. My viewers and subscribers, big up on yourself. So, moving on now, Queen Ifrika sued for allegations against her father. You know, <laughs> Queen Africa did state that, you know, her father touched her up, you know? Mm, that's why she sings the song, Daddy Don't Touch Me There. And when the controversy around it, and her brother, them, the daughter of a cease and desist from, refrain from saying so, and, you know, they, right now, them filed a lawsuit against her, and trust me, it's like, all can I wear my dig up back again. You see me? I said, the big general, Derek Morgan, richer and singer, you know? We don't know if a true queen of Africa. Talk people are said them believe her, people are said them don't believe her. You know I mean, you see. So, Jano, are you going to read the piece of the article still? You see it? Yeah, man. The family of ska singer Derek Morgan has filed a defamation lawsuit against Morgan's daughter, popular reggae singer Queen Africa, alleging reputational damage for allegations she made against him in 2023. Merrick Morgan, the son of 83-year-old Ska singer, confirmed that they retained attorney at law Charles Ganga Singh in Jamaica. Yes, it so. And the brother Merrick Morgan, you know, she have two other brothers and I think sister as well. Yeah, but Merrick Morgan was the one who was standing up for his father, saying, "Yo, stop their life, I'm a poopa, You see me? So now he has, he has filed a lawsuit. We don't know if he filed it from them time the last year, and it just have come true. Is me about yeah, deformation of character and so and thing. We don't know how Queen is gonna work out that one yeah, or she's gonna stick to her stance. Is me? And, and say, yo, it did happen for true. Is me? Me can't prove it, so we don't know if I true, we don't know if I lie, but we know those things do, do happen. Is it? My viewers and subscribers, yeah, but me personally, I don't know if I true or a lie. Is it? We just go to out there, you know what I mean? And, Hopefully them can resolve this as brothers and sister and she just drop the argument then, you know, well and you know, because this, this now gonna go away again, you know. This is a big scare, a big scar and 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 Mary, um Derek Morgan, you see me as a big scare you know, legendary the scare singer, you see it so even when they when Makril Makril Akosar, Makril brought it up back again. So it now gonna go away. People are gonna always say to Queen Africa when they make her. Your daddy touch you on this and that, you know? Yeah, and you don't know, so. The brother them will go through with a lawsuit. Again, I don't know if them can solve it, resolve, I know, resolve it as brothers and sister, but I don't know my viewers and subscribers. But I hope you can do the best. You see, let me know what you are think in the comment section below. Moving on. Me tired and me fed up by it. So much violence in the place. Yeah, man, so where do you want shooting go on? Uh, I'm part of Hanover there. I tell you, say, yo. Like the man them a work, work um a fix up on bar or something, you know, some renovation thing and some man pull up on them and wreck at the place. You see, I think father and son get dirt, you know. Sad shocking, you know what I mean my viewers and subscribers. I don't know when the violence are going in there. I know over on them places eh, get hot. They use a nice them countryside there, you know. You see me? Why me I tell a star? You know, me and the man of peace, you know. He can't take the crime and violence in the star, but anyway. Yeah, the police them give a breakdown and rundown of what happened. And then, you know, John was star. Tired and fed up by it, man. Oh, the authority last night, right here in the Johnstown district of Manova. A shooting incident occurred right at this building there in the air. Where some men were in the building doing some work. While they were there, gunmen approached the building and actually opened gunfire at them. Two of them died on spot. Two other persons were shot and injured taken to the hospital. One succumbed to his injuries this morning. So three persons would have died as a result of this incident. These type of killings are senseless. And these killings must be stopped. Friends killing friends, brothers killing brothers, community members killing each other. It must be stopped. These killings are senseless. Now, the investigation at this time is still early. But our team is working assiduously to see if we can bring this one to a solution. So, no lead at this moment as to what has caused such a gruesome act within the Johnson Town community. With the support of the community, we can definitely solve this crime. I'm imploring the members of the community to support us in solving this crime. Tell us what you know. Tell us what you see. 
tell us what you hear. We need your support. Yes, man. Say, so, yeah, the police are getting a breakdown of what happened. You know, Johnson Town, there, I'm part of the over there. Boy, I'm mean, telling you. I don't know them places to come here, town, man, still, but you know. It's sad, man. RP to those three people, families and friends, and relatives, viewers and subscribers. When will it end? Yeah? Yeah, man. Yeah, the police are telling us, yeah, tired of this friends killing friends. You see me? Brothers killing brothers. Sisters setting up brothers to lose their lives. When will it end? Jano star, the youth them now living a life star. I wonder, I wonder what the, the death toll right now from January. I wonder if it surpassed last year already. Jano. Viewers and subscribers, be careful, be safe out there. And talk to your kids, them. tell them, be careful who they're hanging around, who you're mixing up with. Be careful of them. Don't stop from picking up badness because it's not here. A lion foot, bless up.